the Africa Exim Bank, the Africa Development Bank, the Caribbean Development Bank, the CARICOM Development Fund have a duty to work with us all to ensure that whatever is necessary to make both the financial and economic case of connectivity is put in place because the next major step of cementing this relationship is not about leaders coming and mixing with other leaders but it is about ordinary people moving in their own time and space to be able to make those friends, to make new family, and to make new business. And it must now also, as it did in the area of the African Medical Supplies Platform, continue where pooled procurement is critical, both to access difficult provisions or equipment, where our orders, as I said, are simply too small, and to guarantee better pricing that we cannot do as market takers and not as market shapers. In the case of Barbados, we currently home port cruise ships and take people from the United Kingdom every week in the winter season to cruise the Caribbean. And when you ask those in Africa, why aren't we seeing more people there is a problem of the transit visas in the North Atlantic countries. If we allow the denial of visas to our people in the North Atlantic countries to define how we can trade, then we truly deserve whatever comes to us.